Welcome back for more reptiles, archery, engineering. Ladies and gents, have fun and please enjoy. Alright, time to turn on the lights for the beer dragons. There's my boys. And it's cloudy, it's gonna rain today. Nah, that's not bad. Nah. Hey ladies and gents, there's a scorpion here. It's 7.34. Uh, I just, I was slowly whacking up, that's all. So today, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I gotta have breakfast, I gotta put heat cream on my shoulder, it's causing me pain in the neck. So, yeah. So right now, it's Wednesday. And I don't know if it's gonna be okay to practice, but yeah. But first things first, I gotta help my parents to get a new. What the fuck was that? Next door. Eh, weather snipping. Great. So, I gotta help my parents first, and this one girl, so yeah. So right now, I'm going to just relax. You know, watch YouTube. And just, yeah. So right now, my boys, are, they had a, a good time yesterday. Look at both of them, they are bright yellow. Wow. Yeah, both of them are shedded. Uh, Chevy's still shedding his tail, but yeah. Bit by bit. So right now I'm gonna have have my breakfast and I'll see you guys later. <laughs> All right, it's time for feeding the dragons. Time I gotta feed them with the mealworms first. I gotta feed the I gotta feed the crickets so they can get more fat than than ever. So right now, get the feed bar. What the fuck is that? Dead nearly. Alright. Tweezers. Mouse up there. Hey, Chevy on that was his chain. And he's right here. He's going big. Alright. Stumpy's mouth is a little bit open. Now after lunch I gotta do some practice before tonight so yeah. Hey baby boy. It's okay. It's okay. You're hungry? Yes you are. Alright, let's feed these two dragons. Then after lunch, let's do some practice ready for tonight. But the thing is, I'm going to cut the video off before I go. So I can film it ready for tomorrow. So that's going to be good. That's three. Four. Five. Seven. Eight. Nine. <laughs> My mom and dad's feet in my knees, so that's good. So right now, I gotta feed these two dragons in. After lunch, we go to the archery, do some practice. Then when tonight comes, We'll be ready, so it'll be absolutely great. Right, yeah. I'm gonna feed these two little monsters first. My little two dragons. Two 
til det. See how damn boys. Yo, hungry little monsters. <laughs> There's two more worms there. Look at you. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to sift these out before I go to the archery to soften them. Um, I gotta go to the archery, do some practice, then when tonight comes, I'm gonna hit those targets straight in the middle where it hurts. So that's good. Now, right now, that's the meal leaves. I don't know how many I put in there, but yeah. All right. Where's the where's the green ones? That's one, two, three, four. Get that dead one out of there. Five, six. So eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four. 16, 13, 18, 9, 20. So that's 20 milliwims and 20 supers. So that's good. Now let's feed these two little hungry monsters. <laughs> My boys. I love you too, but you two are two wild dragons. I love. Put them in the fridge. Now, boys, are you gonna be okay? over here so yeah my boys are super super hungry now after lunch we gotta go to archery do some practice and then go to archery again in the afternoon about 7 p.m. I won't be at home watching home away but I want to win this it's all about friendship and Caring, so yeah. These two are sloppy friggin' eaters. <laughs> so yeah, um, about my bear dragons, they are much easier to handle than snakes. I never liked snakes in the first place, so I never get a snake at all. I love dragons. I love my bear dragons. I like lanterns. I like blue tongues. Um, but yeah, I handled blue tongues before, and I handled them since when I was at my old place. I used to breed them, and that is absolutely an easy question to answer. I used to breed. I used to breed um, blue tongues. They were from my little brother, but yeah, all of them died from the cold. Uh, that was a couple of years ago. But yeah. You fish already! Holy shit. Okay. That's good. That's good, you two. Piece of food right there. Alright. Move these and move these two. So I can put the grass in. It's okay. Hey, stay up there. 
I know, you love that Shiv. I know, I love you too. My big boy. Alright, let me put the grass mat in. Okay. So you can climb on there wherever you want, hey? There you go. So yeah, that's the feeding done. And these two are happy. So yeah. That's pretty good so far. And it's only what's the time now? Eleven oh five. Oh, got a text message. Oh, um, Alright. So right now, people are starting to like Red Dead more than ever. Because the last episode yesterday, that was about 7 hours ago and 37 minutes. Episode 53, where Arthur died and Arthur, I saved him. But no. Jesus. See, these two are such a perfect dragons. Um, trying to find females for these two is rare as rock on shit is it's only what's the date? First the 31st. Alright, the 31st is today of in January, so tomorrow's gonna be the first of February, so yeah. February is the last month of summer. So it's gonna be a little bit cool, but that's okay. Hey, my boys. I love you both. But Chevy, you are shedding really beautiful. You're finally shedding your old, your old tail skin. Well, that's a little bit light, but you had a really good soaking in that warm water of mine, hey? Yeah. What I did is I put lukewarm water in a um, big bucket about this big and that shallow but put that much in the bucket so he lies down flat so the water goes over him for about 30 to 35 minutes then I put him in the heat lamp so wherever he's drying the old skin lifts and he can peel it, peel it off by himself I'm still doing that and Right now, his tail is actually looking beautiful, but his old skin's still shedding off, so I need to do that a couple of times, and I might do that this afternoon before I go, but yeah, let's see what happens. Um, but after lunch, let's go to the archery field, do a practice, come back home, have dinner, then go to archery about 7 p.m. So yeah, 7.30 too late. So I need to be there earlier. Hey. How you doing, Chef? How you doing? How you doing? <laughs> well, what's this? Uh, I can actually track them with this I 
height. <laughs> don't, don't hit your nose, baby boy. Uh, what am I gonna do with you? See ya. Sorry for um the long hours because I've been helping mum and dad with the new washing machine. The old one packed in and it died in the ass. So yeah. So right now Yeah. So right now, I gotta do some practice after lunch so I can get ready for that. Then when the contest starts, whoever gets the sharp shing is gonna be the winner. Whoever's gonna get the nine or tens. But if I bring my recurve to there, it will be much easier. But I have not used my recurve for a while but yeah but I'd rather use my compound yeah, it's more better for me to use anyway you right Stumpy you got a piece of bark in your mouth baby boy oh he's got a piece of bark in his mouth come in my little one Let's take it out of your mouth. There you go. Take care, my baby boy. I love you. I love you too, Shabby. But hopefully, hopefully, I'll win this contest. Because this is a Wednesday contest for those who shoot better. Never. Uh, shit. But yeah, it's always good to practice first. So right now I gotta drink my coffee, I gotta get ready to go to the archery. I'm gonna relax after that. And then in the afternoon is the real contest. That sweeper is very noisy. Yeah, bugger that. Where the hell it opened up the window? Someone open up the window really wide. <sighs> oh well. See ya. So right now, I'll see you guys at archery after lunch. Till then, let's do some practice before the contest starts this afternoon. So I'll see you guys over there. All right, let's set up the bow. Do some practice shots. Three arrows, three shots. Okay. And then my right hand and my left hand is not doing good, it's really bruised. So let's set up this um, bow up and did some practice shots. Then, yeah, tonight's a big night. Okay. 
Okay. Right up. out the bow for that big target over there even the small targets right in the middle so now I'm gonna do practice runs but tonight is the big event anyway so yeah this is gonna be absolutely fantastic so yeah I got Bruce hand across here. It's not that funny. It hurts. I punched the fridge. Far up. Okay. Hopefully I do good. All right, 18 meters to the target. So I need to practice before the others are come, uh, come over tonight. So yeah, t right now I'm to uh, do practice. Gotta take this friggin' bandage off. It's got a friggin' Hey Martin! Michael, how are you? Oh I'm enough for you. <laughs> it is pretty warm out here. It's about it's about 31, 32 degrees outside. Yeah, yeah it is, yeah. I'm going to do some practice shots so I can get ready for tonight. Tonight? Yeah. Uh -huh. Tonight's, um, I don't know what kind of event was Ian said about tonight's on Wednesday, but I'm coming along. I'm going to go do practice shots. Oh, they're having a shot tonight? Yeah. Ah, off the seat for something? Um, yeah. It's like it, it shoot three hours on the target and whatever number you go, it goes on the little scoreboards through the day. So how am I doing my if I am I doing practice and if I'm more better I will beat Jim. Ah oh, right, right, right. You know, all of them's using compound, that everyone's using um Bebo and I'm using the compound. Oh, right. So what's the difference? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. Well, I did the toilet, I did the bins, and I checked the uh, four and three there. But, you know, the three down? Yes. Yeah. yeah. I did yeah. a change all in, eh? Oh. So you done, so done a little work right here? Yeah, yeah. Once a week I come to do the, the bins mm -hmm. and the recital and put the bins outside and do the toilet. And then if there's any time left, then I do the gutters or, or whatever is needed to repair. And, mm. uh, All right, Martin. All right, have a nice one tonight. Let's see yep. you Saturday on the meeting. Mm -hmm. One third, isn't it? It's about 7 o'clock. Oh, okay. okay. 7 o'clock well, is everyone arrives and 7 we start shooting. And if we score big, big numbers, yeah. someone's got to be on the top board. Yeah. But so, uh, what I understood is that we have to vote about two things, and the yep. first thing is that the change in the constitution, in a way, mm. they want younger people to be voting. Yep. So I'm curious about that one. Yeah, I'm very curious about it. I'm not. I'm not that young. I'm nearly to my thirties. No, but but what I, <laughs> I I want to find out was that if we have young people. Give you voting right from 12 year old. That that's very early, by the way. Yeah. Do they become then also full paying members? I don't know. You have to talk to Kelly about that. Yeah, but but that should be clear before you vote for something. Hmm. And 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 the way is that I don't know of you, but the the working bees that hardly any young people turn up at all. 
that mean is a, a so we, sh we should have a policy put in place that if young people getting a vote mm -hmm. they should also be coming to carry the load a little bit because you know there's not only fun and play mm -hmm. it is also work to be done you saw yeah. that on, on on the shooting weekend and, and, and how much work and there were hardly any young people at all and, mm -hmm. I, mean, and I think that if we still have young people uh, 18 years to 16 I can understand it because with 16 years you can go for your driving license you know yeah but I, I work with young children in in hospitals and and, and boys homes yeah. and from 12 to 16 mm. uh, just to give them a vote is, is what helping us I don't know I don't know I like to know that and, and mm. And that they can come to vote about something that they not even probably be involved in at all. Mm -hmm. So we maybe have to ask Kelly that or separate. Yeah. All right, have a nice shot. See you next time. Yeah, see you, man. Three arrows, so ah, this freaking hand hurts. It's all along there. Oh well, I'm still shooting. I'm not gonna give up on it. All right, three arrows, three shots. Big numbers or small? All right. Not bad at all. Second round. 
Oh, my freaking hand hurts like far out, man. Mm. Because I haven't read it. Alright, how many rounds? One, two, three, four, five, six. Alright, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So there's ten rounds. So I've done the first round. All good numbers. I think after this, we might go home and see what the brains are doing. Alright, second round. Ah, fuck up my hand. That's annoying. That's a good straight number. Eight. How about this? If I make it easier, oh, what's a piece of paper I can write it down on? Oh, this is not gonna be fucking easy at all. So I got two eights and a nine. All right. All right, I got two eights and a nine. Eight, double nine. I'm not going to do that bad at all. I'm going to kick Jim's ass. That's beautiful. Hold that a fort. That was three nines. That was freaking three nines. Oh yes. I just see, I just saw it closely. That was three nines. So second round, three nines. Yes, I'm not gonna do that bad at all. Three nines on the second round. <laughs> Yes! Alright! So Two eights and a nine on the first round. Three nines on the second round. What's next? Oh, my freaking hand's stinging like fucking hell. I done punched the fridge for the for, on my side of the hand and it's stinging like fucking hell. But I'm getting good numbers. So how many rounds are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So there's ten rounds. So if I get all these rounds done, I might beat Ian and others. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. 
third round. Let's do it. Seven. No. Get seven. That's a seven. That's a ten. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes! Ah! Freaking amazing! Okay! Yes! <laughs> all right, all right, I think I proved my point. I think Ian taught me very well. So, third round is seven, ten, ten. That's freaking amazing. That is cool. So how many rounds I got left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Got seven rounds left, so. Ah, oh, this is cool. All right, ah, oh, freaking bruised hand. Ow. Ah. Yeah, I should not punch the fridge. Alright, third What is it? Third round done. All these are big numbers. Absolutely big numbers. Let's do the fourth round. That's an eight, not seven. All right, that's a seven. So again. Nine. So I need to wax the string. So that's not bad. Go wax it. So let me mark this down.
Yep. I was right. Seven, seven, nine on the fourth round. And I'm not doing that bad. But right now I gotta wax my bow and let's do some more shots. Then leave the other shots ready for tonight. So let me have a break and I'll see you guys after. Okay. Those four rounds was doing good. Now I gotta put this hand bandage on. Is my right my left hand's really bruised, so it's bruised right here and I don't like it to get any more any more pain. And it's really painful when wherever I squeeze my hand it freaking hurts because I punch the fridge like that and it bruised along there, so I am so much in pain in the hand. Um, my shoulder pain is gone, but yeah, I created more pain in my hand now, so not surprising, but I'll, go, I'll get used to it. So let's do two more shots and let's call it. See, I'm only going to do this tonight. Hopefully I'll win. Because this is my only chance if I can get... Well, I haven't got my medal yet from the 208 points from the 45 meters yet. So, I have to find out. Oh, this looks weird. Uh, I look like I got the Assassin's Creed blade. Great. <laughs> All right, two more, two more rounds. Ah, oh, this hand is such a painful friggin' shit. Ow. Okay. Then not win that one, but that sounds really deep. All right, let's do it. So, 
I got eight double tin. What the fuck was that? Oh, ladies and gentlemen, I think we are not alone in this freaking garage. Just like in my imagination. All right, last round on 18 meters. I'm not gonna do close meters because that's quite cheating. Because I don't know how this goes. So I'm starting with 18 meters. That's all I'm going to do. So last round and finish it. So after this, we gotta go to Bunnings to get a two meter washing machine um, hose. So yeah. Oh, my freaking hand. All right, last round. That's nine, that's good. Lizard poop. Yeah, bloody bugger. Ah. Oh yeah. Ah. I don't know. I think that's much better right now, so, yeah. Sorry I did not, um, in, uh, I'm sorry I did not start when I pulled up. 
but yeah. But right now, let's pack up and call it full right now. But tonight is the night, so right now we gotta pack it up and get ready for tonight anyway. I need to get relaxed and not in pain, so I need to get relaxed anyway. So I'm doing 18 meters. Not doing bad. Yeah, 18 meters. My eyesight's not that bad. I've been doing 45 meters from. Yeah, about 45 meters. Uh, like you guys watch me each Saturday and Sunday, I did 45 meters. So let's take my bow away and. Call it for tonight. So, yeah, this is gonna be absolutely freaking awesome tonight. So, that's beautiful. I got my scores right now. So, right now I gotta go to the Bunnings and get this hers for my mum. So, right now let's pack it away and call it for right now and go tonight so hopefully I'll have my camera with me to record the event even the fun fact of it so that's beautiful so 18 meters not that bad For the size, it's not that bad at all, so yeah. So, right now, let's pack the bow away, go to Bunnings, get a 18 meter hose, and get it all done. So, yeah. Whew. I think this is gonna be an easy challenge for me tonight. So I just done 18 meters, not 20. So 18 meters, done. So bugger that. <laughs> that hit, I'm gonna be buggered. I need to pack my friggin' trigger away and my arm guard. I actually done absolutely perfect for now. That's pretty good. So 18 meters, like the line between your legs, point towards the target, done. And I've done big numbers, so that is done. So right now, I gotta pack my bow away into the car, and I gotta go to Bunnings, and I'll see you guys back at home. Okay. That was absolutely good, damn, damn good practice at uh, archery. Yeah, for the, um, where the contest is, I don't absolutely freaking good. I've got nines, eights, two sevens, and three tens. That's absolutely a good proof of my skill. So, yeah, number one. If you're versing a professional shooter, don't don't have a verse him because he'll kick your ass after you blink, before you blink anyway. So yeah, I talked to my friend Jennifer today, so that's absolutely good. I haven't heard from her for a long time. And I thought it was Jack on the microphone and that's why I did not go on group chat because all his bullshit is near yeah, himself, but 
Yeah. But right now, I've done an absolutely good practice. You guys saw me smiling because I've done an absolutely freaking awesome practice. So tonight is the big night. And I'll bring my camera with me and my bow to see who's the main freaking winner. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, subscribe, and comment. Till then, it's three fifteen right now, so it's, it's fifteen fifteen, and I'm I'm really happy. So I'll see you guys tonight at our archery doing the contest. Till then, peace for now. Oh, friggin' I hate my hand. Till then, I'll see you guys tonight. Till then, there's no possum watch tonight. I'm gonna skip that. Do the contest. So I'll see you guys next time. Till then, stay tuned for the next video for tomorrow. And I'll show you the contest after it. Till then, peace for now. Get over here.